I'm in general a pretty happy person, and I would say 80% I am happy, maybe 20% I'm not so happy. Probably a nine most of the time. I feel pretty happy. An overall seven out of 12. Yeah, on a scale of one to 10, I'm definitely a nine. I'm pretty, I'm I would happy. say I'm pretty happy. Yeah. I mean, it's hard not to be happy with these two guys. Two, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. I'm really content with my life right now and enjoying life. Pretty happy, pretty satisfied with most things. Yeah. We are really happy. Right now for me, it's family and free time. Self-fulfillment and relationships. My health, my family, my children, my girlfriend, my stepchildren. Making sure that I actually seize the day and do things and don't just lay around the house. And my dog, my dog. <laughs> Uh, the people standing beside me right now, and animals. What matters most to me, I would say, this little guy. Family. Family. Family, I would say. My family definitely matters the most to me in my life. I guess happiness and success, but like, you know, whatever you can do to feel happy. <laughs> it doesn't have to be like a lot of money to be successful. Living in Saskatchewan, I love that we have four distinct seasons. And the weather keeps you on your toes. The river is excellent. The heat is great. The winter is a challenge, but we can handle it. Not having to walk up hills is pretty nice. Yeah, not having to walk up hills is amazing. Yeah. It's honestly a, a cultural melting pot. My mother lives in Saskatoon. My extended family lives in Regina. I'm trying to get out of here, actually. Nothing in particular. I feel like I could live anywhere, essentially. I live mostly in my mind. Uh, it's, the people are relatively get alongable. I don't really like Regina that much, but we won't, <laughs> we won't say that. Uh, Saskatoon is honestly gorgeous, and I love living here. I wouldn't live anywhere else, currently. I'm quite satisfied with my current employment. I'm pretty satisfied as I can be. <laughs> Like, it's a good job, it's a stable, like, pays you know, bills. pays the bills. Yeah. My current employment, I am, I would say, uh, like a 9 out of 12. I love being a nurse, and being a nurse in Saskatchewan is all I've ever known, so I'd say I'm really happy with my employment. Um, kind of not really right now, because I'm kind of in the process of looking for a job right now. Either that or get into school. Pretty satisfied. I get to act at Shakespeare in the Saskatchewan all summer. Awesome. Sometimes it can be a little bit much, uh, especially with deadlines and everything. I mm -hmm. work with a music label. I'm, a, I'm an artist. And um, for the most part, the only thing I really have to worry about is music. But that can be a double-edged sword. It could be either really good or really, really bad. I'm, I'm happy, though. I'm very, very happy. What do I wish I had more of? Uh. I don't know. Um, time. Time. Free time. Free time. Time. Hours in the day. I actually wish I had more time with my family. Spend some more time with my family. More time. <laughs> more, more months of summer, for sure. Summer. Or fall, actually. Travel time. I want to go places. <laughs> and money. <laughs> Yes, I do. Not really, but kind of, yes, I do. No, absolutely not. I think it's just a cultural thing where you can just never be satisfied with where you are and your potential is infinite. And I don't feel very infinite right now. Not disappointed, but not infinite. You can't really always live up to your own potential because that changes every day. But the idea is to be open as you can to do whatever comes your way. I feel like I've ex already exceeded my where I thought I'd ever be in my life. Mm -hmm. um, you know, blessed to be alive, blessed to be doing what I'm doing, and I don't know how to deal with it. <laughs> I am at my pinnacle. I'm never not gonna be at my pinnacle, people. I feel more and more each year like I am living up to my potential. I'm turning 40 in a few days, and I really feel like things just keep getting better and better.